Hello guys, this is Deepika from MyTutorialRack.com. In this tutorial, we are going to go ahead and look at another interview question. So the question is, a custom object contains some records and the requirement is to create the field in this object with master detail relationship. Can we create the master detail relationship in this case? To simplify, what they're asking is, let's say you have a patient object. It's a custom object. You have a patient object and you have added some records in this patient object. Now, once you have added this, some records are available. Now you're trying to create a master detail relationship on this custom object or try to create a field of type master detail relationship on this patient object. Can you do that if you already have existing record? No, you cannot create a master detail relationship if the custom object already contains existing records. So how you can do that? There is a, there, what we can call, there is a way to do it. There is a way to create a master detail relationship, but you have to follow these steps. So the first thing is you cannot create directly a master detail relationship. You first create a lookup relationship and that lookup relationship field, as you already know, it is not a required field. So that's why you will be able to create a lookup relationship field first. And then what we're going to do is we will go to each of those records and we will associate the lookup field with the parent record for every record. So basically you're going to base, provide the value for that lookup field for each of those records. Then once you have provided the associated the lookup field with the parent record for every record, then what we're going to do is we are going to change the data type of the field from lookup to the master detail. So this is how you can create a master detail relationship on a custom object if the custom object already contains records. So if, if you're directly trying to create a master detail relationship on a custom object, which already has some existing records, it will give you an error. You will not be able to create a master detail relationship, but you can create a lookup relationship for that custom object. You can create a lookup relationship field on that custom object. Then what you do is you go over to each of those records and you try to associate that lookup field with the parent record. And once you have provided the lookup field value for each of those records, then you can change the data type field from the lookup to the master detail. So this is how you create a master detail relationship on a custom object if the custom object already has some records available. So let me go ahead and give you an example here. So if I go back to my developer console, let's say, and uh, here what we have we have a patient information let's say i wanted to add another field so first let's go ahead and create patient name and then we're going to create a new field for the patient age let's say so we're going to go ahead and uh, create a number field here so we're going to go ahead and choose the number field and hit the next button and here we're going to call it as age and uh, then I'm going to go ahead and hit the next visible to all and then hit the next and then save. So what I've done is I have created another field called age on this patient object. Now every patient will have some associated with a doctor, right? So let's go ahead and create another custom object and we're going to go ahead and uh, we'll create a new custom object here and we're going to call it as a doctor and the plural label would be doctors and then we're going to go ahead and uh, it'll have a doctor name and we will allow the reports activities field history etc and then we will also create a tab for this custom object then hit the save button and then it's asking you to pick a tab style so i'm going to go ahead and pick a tab style here and then hit the next button and then next and include the tab and then hit the save. So now what I've done is I have created another object called doctor and it only has one field called doctor name. So let's go ahead and add another field called uh, called number of years of experience the doctor has let's say. So we'll go ahead and uh, 
we'll add another field called experience and here we're going to hit the next button i'm just making it just to make you understand and then hit the next button and then save so what we have done here is we have created fields on the doctor object there is a field that we have added called experience and then what we have is if we have also added a field called age on the patient let's say i create some records under this patient object so let's say the first patient is john and he is 60 years old then hit the save button then we are going to create another patient let's say and we call it as adam and uh, let's say he's 45 and then hit the save button so what we have done is we have created two records now if i try to create a master detailed relationship on this i will not be able to do that so if i try to create a master detailed relationship between the patient and the doctor where the patient is is the child or we can call it as a detail and the doctor is the parent or we can even call the master if you try to create a master detail relationship between the doctor and the patient let's see what happens so if i try to do that let's go ahead and uh, click on this quick access menu and hit the new button it is going to give an error so if i try to create a master detail relationship you're going to go ahead and hit the next button related to it is related to which it is related to doctor and hit the next button and the field name we call it as doctor and hit the next and the next and the next and the save so you got an error saying you cannot create the master detail relationship you are getting this error because patient already has some records available and then you are trying to add a master detail relationship field on this patient object so the, the error message says you cannot create a new master detail relationship on an existing object if the records already exist so this is what the error is that you cannot create a master detail relationship field on an object if that object already has some records available and it also gives you the solution it says you must first create a lookup relationship populate the lookup field with the data in all the records and then change the relationship type to master detail so it is giving you step by step what you need to do so you cannot create a master detail relationship if the records are already available in that object you first have to create a lookup relationship then you populate the lookup field with the data in all the records and then you change the relationship type to master detail so this is what the solution is so going back here i will go back to the patient again and here i will create a new field and this time the field would be the lookup relationship not the master detail it is going to be the lookup relationship and then hit the next button and it is related to what it is related to doctor and then hit the next button and uh, the field name is also going to be doctor so you just have to tab out and it will automatically populate the value and then hit the next and then visible to all and then hit the next button and then next and then you hit the save so now in this case we are able to create a lookup relationship so if you go here you will see a third field got added and it is a lookup relationship now before we populate the values it is going to go ahead and ask you to connect to a particular doctor right so let's go ahead and fill some doctor information so let's say the doctor name is manish and experience is about five years let's say and uh, then we are going to create another doctor here we'll call it as ali and he has about 20 years of experience so we have added two doctors now going back to the patient we were able to create a lookup relationship without any issue so we are going back to each of those patient records and we are going to populate the value of this doctor so here we are going to say the doctor for adam is ali and uh, for the second record that we have john we will automatic we will populate the value for the doctor for him as well so we are going to go ahead and 
say Manish is the doctor for John. So we are following step by step. We first created a lookup relationship. After we have created the lookup relationship, we provided the value for the lookup relationship field on the records that are available on that custom object. Then what we can do is we can change the field type. I can change this lookup to, to the master detail relationship. So you can change this field type from lookup to master detail. So how if I go back to edit and say here, change the field type. Now in this case, I can select master detail relationship. Now I should be able to create this field. So if I go ahead and hit the save, I was successfully able to change the field type from lookup to master detail because first I created the lookup relationship. Then I populated the value of the lookup relationship in all those existing records. And then I changed the field type from lookup to master detail. So they might ask you, the, the interviewer or the employer might ask you that, hey, I already have some records available in an object. Can I create a master detail relationship? The answer to that is no, but you just should not stop there. You should tell them the solution also that, hey, you cannot directly create a master detail relationship if the records are already available. What you can do is you create a lookup relationship on that object. Then you populate the values of that lookup relationship field with whatever the parent record for every record. And then you change the data type of that lookup field to master detail. So that way you can create a master detail relationship on a custom object if the object already has some records.